The survey, The American Freshman National Norms Fall 2010, reports that the emotional well being of college freshmen has declined to the lowest level in 25 years. Today's teens are reeling from the stress of both today's recession and academic pressures. That pressure to achieve too often starts long before college. I guess in middle school they start emphasizing it. They're like, okay, you have to start getting good grades because colleges will look back even at your like eighth grade year if you're on the brink of getting in or not getting in. 29% of the college freshmen surveyed this year said they had been frequently overwhelmed by all they had to do during their senior year of high school. Sometimes I find that I take too many things at once. Track, academic bowl, math team, science olympiad, science bowl, debate club. I mean, it's really time consuming. High school junior Aubrey takes advanced classes and spends some of her time away from school teaching dance. She knew that pushing herself hard gave her a good shot at her college of choice, but it also took something away. You don't get as much chance to just be a kid. And so there's a lot of things that you don't experience, and it's almost as forced maturity. And but it's not real maturity, you know. Parents are often so pleased their kids are pushing themselves hard, they forget to take a hard, long look at how much stress they are enduring. An immense amount, an immense amount. Experts say parents and teachers can help alleviate anxiety by placing value on traits like honesty, integrity, and developing resilience, and teaching their children that there is more to lifelong success than grades and trophies. The most important thing is you don't underestimate nor do you overestimate your expectations of your child's performance. You Let your child school, know that regardless of their level of success, that you love and you value that child. I'm Stacy DeWitt for Connect With Kids.